30 guns were stolen from a firearm store in New Whiteland over the weekend. Yeah, police have already recovered at least one of those stolen guns in another city. Wish TV Sierra Hignite joins us now with what happened. Sierra? It happened around 4 a.m. on Saturday morning. Police say the thieves broke into this gun shop behind me and raided it, but the owner says they didn't trash the place. He said it seemed like the thieves knew exactly what they were doing and knew exactly what they were looking for. Surveillance video shows the moment thieves broke into Element Armament in New Whiteland and stole 33 guns. They escaped before police arrived, but police say one gun was recovered nearly 24 hours later when a Southport police officer tried to pull a car over early Sunday morning for running a stop sign. The vehicle crashed. Um, person fled. We didn't get. Uh, we weren't able to apprehend him, but we did get the vehicle, and in the vehicle was a, a stolen gun. The owner of the shop says the thieves didn't take accessories and they only left behind four guns out of the entire store. The gun shop owner says now not only has he lost more than an estimated $30,000 in product, but he's also lost some peace of mind knowing that 33 of his guns are in the hands of criminals. It doesn't take long for him to travel around. Already with at least one gun outside county lines, police say time is of the essence in locating the suspects and the weapons. Are they using it for themselves? Are they selling them to other people? You know, where are they going? Well, that's because we do know there's 30 some guns on the street right now that aren't supposed to be, and we don't know who has them. People who were nearby were shocked when we told them what had happened just a few doors down. Definitely surprising her something like that happened in this area in Tracy Plaza. Police say this is now a concern of public safety after multiple robberies have happened in the last month where a firearm was stolen. And these aren't good guys who took the guns, you know, so they took them for a reason. Now, what's that reason? And they're not afraid to use a gun. The fact that that's even a possibility um, to be in our neighborhood, to be in our park, to be in our school system is really scary. New Whiteland police are working with IMPD and other agencies to investigate this case. They say it could be connected to other recent robberies in the Indianapolis area where firearms were stolen. Live in New Whiteland, I'm Sierra Hignite, Wish TV News 8.